Hello folks, this is 2022 October November paper 13 and the question number is 10. It is about the chapter uh, dynamics here. It is concerned with momentum. She says two blocks are at rest on a frictional horizontal surface. So two blocks are at rest. One block is made of wood and the other block is made of steel. So wood and steel. A steel ball is fired horizontally with a speed V at the wooden block. Wooden block. So steel ball here. The ball embeds itself in the block, uh, and the block and ball and block move together after impact. So for the wooden block, what we have is the steel ball is fired horizontally with a speed v. Wooden block, the ball embeds itself, so gets stuck, and the ball and the block move together after impact. So they move together. That means their velocities will be common velocity, or let us say I can say uh, the velocity of both of them will be equal to, uh, let us say, p final v final uh, and it is one it is one we still have another one so we name it as v final one a second identical steel ball is fired with speed v same thing at the steel block at the steel block the steel block then rebounds the steel ball then rebounds means reflected back along its uh, or, or, original path so same track it follows the same track with speed v by two the speed becomes v by two here is v v by two the wooden block and the steel block have equal masses, so they have got equal masses. So let us name it as M, large M, and large M. So it is large M and large M. Which is statement about the block immediately after the collisions is correct? So we have the several statements here. So let us say the mass of this small ball is M, it is the same steel ball, so it is M here. So what we need to find is uh, after the impact we have to find uh, their velocities so most of them speeds the most of the uh, statements are about speed so one says both blocks must travel the same speed same speed this and this uh, it says steel block must travel faster it says wooden block must travel faster and the other says the masses of the blocks and the steel bar are needed so they feel that uh, the exact value of masses are needed to determine which goes faster so let's uh, uh, apply the equations of uh, momentum conservation to find the velocity. So let us see its velocity is p final 2. P final 2. Let's go for the first condition. For the first condition, what we have is the momentum, initial momentum here, which is mv plus its momentum here, which is m into 0 is equal to the mo total momentum here. So it is m here. Both are embedded. So it is m, uh, m sorry it is m plus m m then v final one since both are going in a combined form their final velocity should be same so that's why i have got vf1 common here so this gives me m v plus equal to equal to m plus m v final one so this gives me v final one is equal to m v divided m plus m m then 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 uh, so it like this so let us uh, write it as it as m by m plus m then 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 v so let me write like this now for the second one for the second one the equation will be uh, so the equation here will be m v plus m into zero should be equal to it's a rest equal to m minus v by 2 since it is reflected back along the same path which will be minus v by 2 plus it is m into p final 2 so p final 2 so this is m v uh, then uh, it goes here minus m v by 2 should be equal to m p final 2 and this is equal to so when i do this it is 2 <coughs> Uh, so this goes a plus here i forgot here plus so it should be equal to 3 by 2 m v so when i arrange it properly it will be like it will back so m sorry v f2 v f2 should be equal to 3 by 2 then m by m then v m by m then v now let us compare these two velocities let us compare these velocities so what we must have is let's compare this thing this thing when we have m by m plus m and m by m we must have we must have compulsorily m by 
m plus m should be should be less than m by m should be than m by m just we can consider an example for example if i have got a 1 by 2 here and if i have got a 1 by 1 plus 2 this becomes a 1 by 3 and this 1 by 3 is definitely less than this 1 by 2 so this is m by m plus m and this will be m by m so m by m plus m will be less than m by m so it means therefore this m by m plus m should be less than 3 by 2 of m by m as well it is just a 1 into m by m this is 3 by 2 m by m so that means that that means this pf1 should be less this pf1 should be less and this should be larger one so that means that we have got pf1 should be less than pf2 so this speed is less than this speed so the first one is wrong last one is wrong it says uh, the mass is exact or uh, required which we don't then it says the steel block must travel faster than the wooden block so what we have proven here wooden block has got less speed than the steel steel block so that's why steel block faster wooden block slower so this is the correct one and this is the incorrect one so the correct choice is choice number b